The Progress Programme is Skills Training UK's uh, contract under the ESF families with multiple problems. We rebranded as Progress really early on in the contract uh, launch so that it has a really positive message and a positive image for families. The programme is a, an employability programme but it's holistic so it's looking at a whole family approach and looking at identifying what those barriers are and understanding that if someone's not in work there are a whole range of reasons why and actually we do need to look at those barriers and, and try to tackle those or someone will never be ready for work potentially. We sit, meet the family and we go through an in-depth needs assessment which is us looking at what those barriers are and really understanding and identifying how we can move forward. So we agree with the family what that progress plan looks like and what progress measures those participants within the family will undertake. The progress measure is a tangible activity, so it could be a certificate, it could be a, a program, it could be some accredited learning, and it's all about moving families closer to and into employment. The progress programme runs throughout the whole of the South East, uh, from Milton Keynes, Buckinghamshire, through Thames Valley, Hampshire, Isle of Wight, Surrey, Sussex and Kent. We deliver some of it ourselves through our own direct delivery, but in the main it's delivered through our subcontractors, of which we have 12 currently, one of which is GFE South, which is the consortium of, of uh, colleges. We've got a real mix and a range of providers, so we have community and voluntary sector, private sector and colleges. We're looking today at Wheatsheaf Trust and Southampton City Limits as a really good example of how two quite different organisations can work in the same community providing a service to the people here in Southampton. So Wheatsheaf Trust are a charity who run quite a few contracts, uh, very community focused and looking at workshops and peer groups whereas Southampton City Limits have adopted a very intensive one-to-one -one support programme for their participants. And both are working really well 